Amen. Amen. Please come, come. The musicians, please play something. They are not the one they sing in America. The one tree that people know. Hallelujah. It's very important. Then, when they are singing that, hello, woman of God, come towards your father, who is the parents of the couple. Amen. Then they are the one that will bring you to the pastor. Glory to God. Let's do the right thing for us. Amen. So sing the one. Where is my sister now? She gone. Sing for us. Sing anything you know that can join us. Sing is the one that we can jump, you know. We jump and touch the roof. Hallelujah. <laughs> Now you are. Where well, those people that dance with that come and dance and, and follow her?
this, this relationship. To God be the glory. My assignment is just to know the legal part of it to ensure that it is done according to the laws of Trinidad today. Gabriel, would you have this woman to be my wedded wife? To live together after God's ordinance in the holy estate of matrimony. Would you love her, honor her, take good care of her, in sickness and in health? Would you forsake all others and keep yourself up to her for as long as you both shall live? If this is what you're going to do, sir, say, I will for all to you. Aisha, would you have this man to be your wedded husband, to live together after God's ordinances in the holy estate of matrimony? Would you love him, comfort him, honor and to obey him in sickness and in health? Would you forsake all others yourself and keep yourself unto him for as long as your boat shall live? If this is what you're going to do, say, I will for all to hear. Amen. The Bible says it's better for a man not to make a vow than for him to make one and don't keep it. Marriage is a serious business. It is not a game. You would stand before God, both of you, to give an